Right, hello YouTube. It feels like it's been fucking ages, and it probably has been fucking ages, but we're currently sat in the MX-5. I was literally about to go and film a video of smoking. I have a joint on my possession. Let me turn them heaters off because it's just going to make shit loud for you. I've got my joint here. If you are new here, because I, this video is going to be titled Sank to do with a Mazda, and we normally smoke weed in our videos, which most people, I guess, don't really like. But I'm just doing this video to film Sank about the MX-5. So if you're watching this video and you're expecting more MX-5 videos on my channel, it's just really videos of me smoking weed, really. But if that's something you're still into, you could give the channel a little peep. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, I'm currently sat outside the Chinese, because if you don't know, I live above a Chinese. I'm currently waiting for my car to warm up because I don't want to sit in it for five minutes and then turn the engine off and then I go and get in it tomorrow morning and it's fucking run the battery dry. But we're going to be talking about my £1,000 MX-5, which isn't super cheap. There is cheaper MX-5s out there, but I've seen them for quite expe not <laughs> expensive isn't really the word because they're not expensive, they're inexpensive. Ugh. It depends what Mazda you want to buy, really. If you want to uh, treat yourself, get the Mark 1, which is admittedly the best one with the pop-up headlights, which is the NA. Uh, or you could be a cheapskate like me and grab yourself an MB, which is kind of the unloved sort of middle child, even though there's four of them. It's still in the middle. Well, both of them are kind of unloved. The, the Mark 2 and the Mark 3 are probably the worst ones. I don't know actually, I'd say the pop-up headlights, Mark 1, Mark 2, Mark 4, Mark 3, my personal opinion. But saying that, the Mark 1, other than the pop-up headlights, is the exact same car, if not this car is probably better than that because it's newer. But we are going to show you around my lovely little Mazda, uh, because I don't think I've actually shown it in a video, I think I've shown the inside like this, just doing an intro to my weed smoking videos. Nothing proper yet though, I don't think. So uh, I try, I do try and film some videos on my car, but my car park's so fucking annoying. Like people can just see in here straight away and it just, I don't like people looking at me when I'm filming shit. I'm trying to pick up the stuff on the floor so it doesn't look like I'm the messy bastard. But uh, let me show you the inside quick. This is the, the interior of probably the bottom spec Mark II MX-5. You can tell it's bottom spec, I haven't got fucking electric windows i have got the buttons for it though i have got keep fit windows which are a bit long but hey ho so this is the dashboard i actually have got a couple problems with this dashboard my speedometer is not working which means my miles are not tracking i've owned this car for about three months and it hasn't tracked any miles for about two and a half if i roll forward in this car park you will see that the speedo does not want to move, which isn't really ideal, but it's good for keeping my miles down. Let me just reverse back into my spot. I'm proper fucking fogged up. Um, but yeah, to be honest, the reason I love this car is because it's so simple. There's no fucking like warning lights or nothing like that. There's no fucking, I don't know. It's just simple. It's like there's no fucking touch screen. It's just a fucking radio and that's that's it really like there's nothing much in it there's not a lot of room i like this bit you can actually get quite a lot of shit up here you'll be surprised actually i'm six foot and i can get in this car quite fine and i've got about a foot of headroom either side there's the glove box it's just the glove box but yeah i think the inside's one of the nicer parts of the car i've never owned a car armrest i'm used to having little one liter cars that are like teeny but um I don't know, they're just, I think they're the best cars you can buy for fun wines. Let me show you my car park. Cause this is where I normally park, but this is an alleyway. So whenever I'm trying to film videos, people always walk up here and they drive along the shops up there and it gets in the way and it makes me feel weird. There's my fucking Japan thing. My, I, I guess he's a King Julian thing, a, a ringtail Lima and fucking Pikachu standard. But let me show you the outside of this car. It is quick uh, raining, so we're not going to be showing it outside too often because it's wet. <clears throat> but I know I've said this a couple times. If you do want to see some more car, uh, car videos, please let me know because it's a bit easier for me to film a car video 
I don't smoke and drive anymore where I used to, unfortunately, because I was a naughty boy. So I can only smoke on my balcony and it's just long smoking on my balcony because I don't really like people seeing where I where I am. And my next door neighbours sit, always sit on the other side of the fucking fence listening to me. I'm a bit of a shy fucker when it comes to shit like that. So I don't like that. But when it comes to filming the shit on my car, I can just film that wherever. I haven't got drive stoned because it's just car videos. But I still, I'm obviously still going to do the smoking the weed videos because that's what the fucking channel's based on. This Mazda is just a little bonus for any of you fucking boys that like weed and cars. So, uh, yeah, we're going to fucking have a look at the outside now. Try not to show off my number plate because I showed off my number plate with my say I beef her, and I'm sure one of you lot fucking called the police and got a fucking tag put on it. I don't fucking know, but not ideal. I'm just not showing it anyway. Because <laughs> then you can see how old the car is and that's not that fun. So turn the ding dong off. Hopefully it starts tomorrow and I've left it running long enough. I'm pretty sure I have, but let's jump outside. A YouTube video about smoking a little bit of weed. I've had to light the joint even though it's raining. It just doesn't feel like the same if I film a video and I haven't smoked in it. But let's look around the bus to quick. Top is the only thing I don't like. Ideally, I want a hard top. But they're fucking expensive. A hard top on these cars set you back like five, six hundred pounds. And when I've spent a grand on the car, spending half of that money on a roof is too much. But there's a quite a few things I need to do. Headlights need to be restored. I want to get them professionally powder coated because I actually like how old they look. It's got that retro kind of vibe. It's not, it's a sports car, but it's not a quick car. I'm not trying to make it anything it's not. Uh, I actually need to repair this. This does not work for some reason. It goes up, but when I'm driving, it just slides back down. But yeah, they're quite cute. So if you want to see some more videos on this, let me know. And I'm sure I could do that. So thank you for watching this video, I really hope you enjoyed I'm so so sorry I haven't uploaded in a while, but obviously it hasn't really been the best of times. I'm not trying to make you feel sorry for me, but uh, obviously Ellie's dad and fucking Christmas and shit like that. It's just been quite a fucking busy time for me. I've got a new job coming up after Christmas, so it's just a bit long. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.